Welcome back everyone. The Verify team has been getting a lot of questions lately about traffic laws like in Texas, do trucks have a designated travel lane on the freeway? Here's investigative reporter Cheryl Mercedes. Whether you're driving on the interstate or parked to pick up a passenger, there are laws meant to help keep you safe. But we know sometimes rumors can cloud your judgment. That's why the Verify team is here to make sure you have the facts. Our first email came from Will. He wanted to know, is it the law in Texas for cars and trucks to drive exclusively in the middle lane on the freeway? Our source for this is Texas DPS Sergeant Richard Standifer. Moving traffic at large has the ability to travel uh, in either lane, inside, middle, or the right lane. There's no law that requires them to travel in the middle lane solely. So we can verify that claim is false. But what about stopping in a travel lane? Belinda asked the Verify team, is it legal for an Uber or Lyft to park and wait in a lane on a main road to wait for passengers? Our source for this one is Texas Transportation Code 545, which addresses stopping, standing, or parking in certain places. The law states an operator may not park in certain places, including on a roadway side of a vehicle parked at a curb, an intersection, or crosswalk except when you're momentarily picking up or dropping off a passenger or merchandise. So whether or not it's legal to park in a travel lane depends on the location and the length of time that vehicle is stopped. And lastly, Deborah, proud owner of a new car, wrote the verified team. It doesn't have a license plate on the front. I was told people don't put them on the front now in certain vehicles and that police don't bother with it anymore. Sergeant Standifer says that could not be further from the truth. Here in the state of Texas, it's required that you have a license plate on the front of the vehicle and the rear of the vehicle. Have that license plate on your dashboard in the front. A lot of people have it because they don't want to drill holes in the front bumper, but it gives law enforcement probable cause to make a traffic stop because it's not on the front of the vehicle. If you are pulled over for having just one plate, you could be fined up to $200. With your Verify, I'm Cheryl Mercedes. Well, there you have it. If you have something you want us to look into, email verify at khou.com or reach out to us on Facebook or Twitter with the hashtag khouverify.